What, what it do, do, what, what it do, do, what it do. do. It's your boy Badger. And it's Maha. And we're back with another reaction. This time we're reacting to another cut video. But this one's from 1 to 10. How races are you? Keep it 100. Keep it 100. 300. How races are you? <laughs> Why are you thinking about it? Zero. Yeah, I think I'm zero. I mean, I feel like everybody stereotypes. Yeah, that's what I was thinking about. I don't I, think that's I definitely racist. Fall I think of hey, racist. Racist is pure hate. Yeah. No, I don't. I, I don't, don't hate. I anybody. don't hate nobody. I don't care. Yellow, blue, orange, red, potatoes, greens, potatoes. Hey. You know what I mean? How racist are you on a scale from one to ten? I'm, I'm gonna say if you live in America and you were born here and you're grown up and you're 50 plus, good luck if you're below five. How racist are you on a scale of one to ten? Racist? Oh. Oh my god. Um. And be honest. Uh. How racist are you on a scale from one to ten? I'd like to say ten, but. <laughs> Dang! Wait, 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 wait. Maybe wait. she didn't know. Wait, I'm confused. Is the one less racist? Right, exactly. Because I'm thinking ten is you're really racist. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. I like to say I'm really, really racist. racist. <laughs> but, you said it with 100% confidence. How racist are you, 1 to 10? A 10. <laughs> I would love to say 10. I might be 11. For all I know. Run the, run the scale. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yo, that is. She, she said Hold that on. with confidence. We might, we might have it wrong. Yeah, we might. I don't know. We'll see. I think being white, I can't say that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, okay, no, 10 means like super racist. Oh, I thought it was the other way around. <laughs> I hate everybody equally. How ra <laughs> Okay. Hey! Can't <laughs> I mean, what can, what can you say about that? So you don't discriminate. Racist <laughs> are you? Uh, zero. 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 The type of family I come from, the type of people I'm around, I'm around a diverse, you know, family, people, and things like that, so, no. Not racist at all? Yeah, no. I wouldn't say so. How racist are you? Between a three and four? Four? I appreciate the honesty. Hey, you can just see in his face. He's being he's being real. He looked like you. He looked like he'll be nice to you until you get to him and get him mm. real mad. Only at level three though. <laughs> yeah, you like you. You're lucky you're I lucky can't I, say it. Lucky, yeah, that's the time you you lucky I can't say it. Oh. Yeah, I'ma call Sorry. the police! I'ma call the police! Uh, okay. Racist. I would say four. A four, just because I think that there are things that I'm ignorant to. So it's not that I sit here to be racist, but I think that there's just things that I still need to learn. Like I don't think that's racist. Yeah. I think it's just that you're ignorant to the whatever the situation is. I don't think that's racist. But does that, to a certain degree, does that make you like inherently racist if you don't know? I don't know. No, it'll, I think if it's, uh, it'll make you a racist if you learn the sit, like say if you're inherently racist towards the situation, and someone teaches you how that's racist, and you still do, and it. you still act like that after the fact. We just taught you it was racist. Yeah. You're a pure racist. <laughs> you are a racist for sure. I definitely feel like I could have better thoughts, like the initial thoughts, and like try to unlearn a lot of things. So. I am a one due to accidental racism. Now give me an example of accidental racism. <laughs> Bro, he just made that up. <laughs> Maybe that's a thing nowadays, I don't know. I I accidentally called him the N-word. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, he got me bad and I just said it. It just accidentally slipped out, I don't know. I'm Filipino and sometimes- Hey! Yeah. Yeah, she's Filipino, y'all. Goodbye, on. What'd you call him? Racist! Racist! Oh. <laughs> People mistaken some people for like different Asian races. For me, because I'm Asian, I definitely will acknowledge like there are times where I'm like, damn, like my people really be doing this. Growing up in like an Asian household, it's more like we discriminate against each other. It was always just like, oh yeah, you know, if you're uh, Chinese, then you're like cheap with like money, but you have money. Korean, then you're gonna be someone that's 
uh, just kind of like put yourself above everyone else, super stuck up. In my Vietnamese household, um, I feel like Vietnamese people, they're a little bit more judgy. And so everywhere you go, um, there'd be things like um, they would point out. And so that's why I started noticing that too. Well, sometimes I'm making joke myself as a thinking on Asian. I can't do this, right? <laughs> Something there is a bad driver I see. I'm just saying, I think she is a female Asian driver. <laughs> I can say because of myself is that. How racist are you on a scale from one to 10? Towards my own race, probably like a five. Who's your own race? I'm Asian and white. So those are the two races I usually pick on. I'm Latinx, I was born in Mexico. Like sometimes I, I met other like, I meet other like Latinx people and they tell me like, you know, some situation and I'm just like, oh yeah, that's such a Mexican thing. How racist are you on a scale of one to 10? I, um, <laughs> she, why Yo. you laugh with her through this? Yeah, in fact, she was just like, oh, I did say something yesterday. <laughs> But I didn't really mean it. She's getting stressed um, out. They, they even asked her again, what's your number? <laughs> Just tell us. Number. Consciously, I want to say one. I mean, I would say like a one. One. Probably like one. Point five. On a scale of one to 10, how racist are you? One. You're confident in that number? Yes. I feel like saying one is, that boy got hair on his neck. I ain't never seen that. Oh, that's, that's how his, you know he got chest hair. You go from chest to your neck. That boy hairy. <laughs> How racist are you? Probably two. My mom was- Why well, I feel like he ain't racist. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that he said he's a dude, I believe him. Pretty broad-minded and she made us broad-minded. We had plenty of contact with everybody. There was Hispanics and colored people. Stop racist! I was really <laughs> Oh man, it's stuck in Jim Crow era. <laughs> Bro, my eyes are starting to water. Oh my, there was I was color. really about to root for him. There was colored people, bro. I, I still don't think he, he didn't mean nothing by it. But why are you still calling us <laughs> colored people? Oh no. Oh my goodness, all right. And Oriental people. Who does racist? <laughs> 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 this man went to a two he to a six. <laughs> <laughs> this man went from a two to a six. He thought he was doing something. But I really thought I was like, oh, this guy don't got a racist yeah. bone in his body. Says all the wrong stuff. I know. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Bro, he's still he's old. He's old. He's old. He's old. Yeah, give him give him a bit. Yeah, of you can doubt. you can extend grace, but like. Oh my goodness! All right. and I know the the words are all changed now, so everyone gets pissed about their little things. How racist are you on a scale from one to ten? I like hope I'm not a ten. I feel like that's a question for other people, not for me. Have you ever said or done something racist? I'm sure I have. Like my. Why can't people just be straight up? She is being straight up. She said, oh, she is kind of like. I'm sure like, I have. I'm sure I have. Like, what? A person has it. Like. Wait, okay, real question. Is microaggression considered, is that part of racism? If you're like being microaggressive towards somebody? Give me an example. Like, like me, like if someone was going to try to touch my hair or something. Oh, and they're just like, oh, oh my, my gosh, gosh your hair is your so hair. curly. Yeah, it's like, do you curl your hair all the time? I get that. By Asians. Yeah, I don't know. Um, well, it goes back to the fact that they're ignorant. Yeah. And they don't know yeah. any better. Or it's like we're, we're talking about black history. Oh, Maha, you know about this. <laughs> that's racist. <laughs> that's racist. No, that's Maha, not can, microaggression. Can you bro. tell us about Rosa Parks? <laughs> <laughs> Why did she not get up? <laughs> Is that your grandma? Wasn't that your grandma? I could have sworn that was your grandma, Maha. <laughs> Oh man! What the freak. <laughs> be like, like you be like, yeah. Never mind. <laughs> Let me just go. On a scale of one to ten, how racist are you? 
Factually, black people do not have the structural power in the United States. Oh States. my gosh, come on! Oh, and just answer the question, lady! Well, uh, naturally, the structural part of the racism systemically comes onto them. <laughs> Shut up! Just answer! One through ten! My goodness, what are you looking up? The actual definition of racist. A person who is prejudiced against an... Or antagonistic toward people on the basis of their membership in a particular racial or ethnic group, typically one that is a minority or marginalized. Okay, so that's what she's basing it off of. Because black people in America have historically yeah, been I get it. marginalized. Yeah, I get it. She's I'm saying a- black people can't be racist. Yeah. But I feel like we can still be racist. I know, to- I just want her to answer the question. Oh, yeah. No, to a certain extent, I feel like everyone can be racist. Like, minority groups can still be racist towards each other. Yes. Like, oh, you can... And we are still <clears throat> There's black people that could hate that they're black. Is that racism? Mm. Is that racism? Towards yourself? Yeah. Hmm. We're really showing our knowledge here, aren't we? <laughs> Say it's to be racist. Racism comes from people in power in a position to have authority against those do, that do not have that power and that authority. Someone who identifies with the minority community, um, it is not possible for me to be racist. So I believe that to an extent. I mean, it's- No, you see, to an extent. Yeah. I feel like there's black people <clears throat> that can purely hate white people because of their race. Mm. Or is it their race or the things in the past? I don't know, I don't know. I just think I'm in the, I don't know, I'm in the middle of that. Is it racist to like be racist to racist? I actually don't believe that black people can be racist. I don't know, bro. Like, I still there's still a couple of like hesit- like hesitant moments with around like white people, especially. I'm predicting how their behavior will be because of the color of their skin, which is like definitely racist. But it's like it's a reaction. It's a reaction rather than like I hate those people. It's like I hate that those people probably hate me. That's not so. I think a lot of black people see racism as in us not liking white people. Like, can a black person not like someone that's Hispanic because they're Hispanic? Yeah. Isn't that racist? Yeah. Because, just because of the color of their skin. Is that if not you, If you don't like someone because of their race, then you're being racist. If it's not to do with, like, your personality, your character, or anything like that. That's just, you don't like them. Yeah. I'm just saying, I feel like there's going to be people in this world. Everything's possible. So it's got to be. I'm sure there's other black people or uh, whatever, like that don't like people because of their race. I'm sure. There's yeah. Out there. Oh, so you're saying like like because of for, their skin. For black people to say, oh, I can't be racist. Yeah, I'm sure there's other. There's, no, I completely agree. I think. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Racist. I don't think all black people like I think there's black people out there that don't mm-hmm. like someone because mm-hmm. of the color of their skin. Yeah. And also you have to think like. American history is not all of world history because True. for for black people in America, like the whole black versus white and the slave trade and all that, that's very prevalent in black American history. True. But like that's not that's What about not the, the UK? World. Like I said, that's not the world. True. But yeah. True, I see what you're saying. So yeah, yeah. I grew up around a lot of Latinos and blacks and they always told me they were all like, yeah, white people's the enemy and we should avoid them. And I always just had that kind of mindset, you know. I realized that the, the anger was hurting me more than anyone else around me. So it just took a lot of self-reflecting, figuring out where that anger was coming from and then, you know, just learning to control it better. There are natural biases, especially when, you know, you like, are a person of color because you, in essence, want to protect yourself and there's a lot of things that have happened to you and people you know. But I would say that I feel like I am very biased sometimes or that I group people and I like kind of go along with stereotypes. A black person can be racist to a Hispanic person. A black person could be racist to Pacific Islander. I can still be prejudiced and hurt somebody so I have to be aware of that. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. That's what that's what I was trying to say. Because mm-hmm. it's like, just as wrong as a white person's race as someone, a black person can do the same thing to any other culture. Yeah. So that's what I think. That's what I feel. I'm gonna go with a four, just because of ingrained shit. Lived in a small town, moved to the big city, and and uh, learned a lot. So. How racist are you? 
maybe like a, a five. I feel like five is a safe number for anyone to start at and then you can work yourself. I think that everyone's really, really biased. So I'd probably say five or six. I think we're all racist given the society we live. The white people agreeing a little too much, ain't they? <laughs> I'm gonna go for a zero, but I do think sometimes, like, if we're not aware, casual racism occurs. So I don't really notice people's color or really. I'm just so tired of it. <laughs> I don't see color. It's okay. Maybe to she's see. colorblind. <laughs> literally. Maybe that's what literally. it is. Literally. <laughs> Maybe she's literally. <laughs> no, it's like when people would be like, I'm colorblind, I don't see anything. Bro, you see what? No, literally. I'm colorblind. <laughs> you are purple to me right now. He's orange. I don't know what's going on right now. I don't know. But nah, nah, yeah, I don't. It's okay to see other people races mm -hmm. establish that they are mm -hmm. black, but it's okay. We're cool with that. I get the good out of the whole I don't see color. Yeah, I get it, I but do. it's like you don't have to say that to see race. That's just my opinion, though. That's just my opinion. Intentionally racist, I would say zero. There have been moments where I've said something ignorant and was corrected. One of my- You see, I can respect that. I can yeah. respect that. I really can. I can respect that. My friends at the time was like Egyptian and I like made an assumption that like one of her gods were a cat. She just- Ooh, That's racist! <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay. Just didn't respond well to that. I feel like you could reevaluate your number, maybe. <laughs> oh no. I, mean, I recognize that I am a white person and I have a lot of white privilege and I've benefited a lot in my career and in the world from the color of my skin. And I can't say that I haven't like, at some points enjoyed reaping the rewards of the colors of my skin. Growing up. Answer the question. <laughs> right. It's like, okay, good for you. We get it. <laughs> we get it. I, it's like, do you want to have some brownie yeah. points for that? No, but at the same time, I kind of, I kind of recognize how in this day and age, though, I got feel like it, a like, lot of people have to put to like, disclaimer, 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 it's disclaimer like, before yeah. sharing your truth. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> what sad. if she was like, like, I understand, like, I benefit for white privilege, like, I, I get it, I get it at the end of the day, but I'm a 10. <laughs> I'm a 10. I hate, I hate Ivory Brace. That's not white. <laughs> I understand. No, that, that would have threw me off. Um, that was predominantly white. I think there's a lot of unconscious bias to me to be mitigated and caring more about seeming like you're a bad person rather than just like genuinely being a good person, whether you get credit for that or not. What's the most racist thing you've done? I don't know if it's like me being racist, but it's like me being in the face of racism and being racist back. So I was in Turkey in 2020 during like China virus um, and people wouldn't let me on public transportation because they thought I was Chinese, so I would just tell them I'm Korean. I would just pick a different race whenever. Like, I was like, Konnichiwa, I'm Japanese. And they'd be like, all right, come on in, you know? So. We were playing on their racism. Yeah, yeah. What's the most racist thing that's happened to you? Well, I've been called a wetback. Um, flat out, I think. Can we rewind it? All right. All the N word. How'd that make you feel? Hurts, you know? Just be judged immediately off of the color of my skin. When I was a kid, like the neighbors used to not play with me because I was black, and they would be they would play with my brother because he was light skinned What can people do to dismantle their own racism? That's a personal journey. As a black man, I'm not here to educate you, but there's plenty of resources out there. I would say look inward in moments where you feel uncomfortable. Lean into that. Ask yourself, why do I feel this way? That is one thing I noticed in um, 2020 with the whole Black Lives Matter movement and what? the pandemic and all that. Oh, um, people when, are like reaching out. Yeah, people will how be reaching you, out to the black people how can like, you educate me? hey, can you give me resources? Or like, how can I do better? Bro, I, why I'm, is that my responsibility? I want to stand by you. <laughs> I'm here for you. Actually, I'm posting a black square. <laughs> Let me post this black square. Um, I'm with you. I posted a black square. Months later. Delete! Get this crap off my page! Get this out of here! Uh, what's the most racist thing that happened to you? That happened to me? One time my friends and I, we tried going into this America's Cup lounge area, mm -hmm. and they were like, no. 
And then the same group of like five white girls try to go up and they let them let in. Let them in? Mm-hmm. Crazy. Me and my brother was followed in Lowe's. Yeah, he told me about that. Yeah, they, we, they followed us. We was going aisle to aisle. And the lady, we could see the lady. Like, she wasn't being discreet. She was just looking. Like, we was in the aisle looking at something. She would come. And then we went to another one. She would look, go yeah. to the next aisle. I was like, bro, what is he doing? And then, to make it even worse, we went to go leave. And my parents were there now. And she's at the same, the where we're at the, what, the cash register? Mm-hmm. And she's there standing there and takes it, the thing out of our cart to put it, make sure we're paying for it. That's ridiculous. And then, like, you can just sense the vibe. My mom was like, what is going on? So I told her, and she called them. was like, yeah, y'all ain't going to treat us there. Yeah. So, yeah, that yeah. that sucked. But, yeah, that's, you know, racism is a sin. It's a sin. It's just hate. You know, so we don't like racism. If I was going to ask how racist am I, I'm a negative on it. <laughs> what about you? Um, so I find this question difficult. 10! She's a 10! <laughs> she racist, y'all! No, she I'm racist! Saying, like, so racist! I'm, I'm not perfect. I don't think nah. I can say a zero either, though. No, I like, mean, even, we all have some ways yeah. about us, so yeah, I get you, I'm yeah, with you. Yeah, you know? Yeah, I get you. But to what extent Think do you say it. racism versus, like, prejudice? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, stereotypes and all that, mm. you know? Because, honestly, anybody walk by my door, <laughs> <laughs> white, black, Asian, Mexican, it don't matter. I don't know you, homie. <laughs> that's me. I treat everyone the same. But, yeah, until then, man, that was another reaction video, man. So, uh, until then, man, we out. Like, comment, subscribe. <laughs> Peace.